This is to demonstrate a really cool feature in Auto Catalog, its search capabilities. So we have all this content, many catalogs, uh, each a separate data file, and then each catalog has many tabs, and each tab has lots of content. But we want to find uh, all the blocks that we've labeled as uh, a letter block, for example. I'm searching for letters. So if I type in my search box letter and press enter, you notice all my letters come up. Or for example, I've named uh, my dynamic blocks. I started them with a DYN. So there again, if I type that, I get all my dynamic blocks. It searches every catalog and every item in every catalog just that quick. But what if I don't have uh, a keyword in there, or the file name is not really what I'm looking for, it's something else? Well, you notice down here I have displayed the item's properties, and keyword is in there. So I can select an item and add a keyword to it. And you can add more than one keyword. And you can add as many actually in there as you want. So now, if I were to search on white, press enter, those items that I flagged as white are now showing up in my results. And if I want white and black, everything that's black or white shows up. If I want to see the items that are have both white and black in them, I can just change from or to and, and now I have one item that has white and black as keywords. So you can get pretty uh, granular with your search, pretty accurate with your search. But typing in uh, the properties window down here for the, each of the items can be a little tedious. And so there's a different way of um, editing keywords and that is using the keyword editor. So when you select that you get a dialog with all your items in there. In this case 592 different items and some of them might be repeated because the same item can appear in many different catalogs or many different tabs. So here I can add the same thing. I can add keyword And once I've added keywords or descriptions, I can type in descriptions there as well because the search function uh, looks in both uh, description, name, path, and keywords. If, if what you type in there is found in any of those places, it'll return that result. So now if I type black and white, because I added those other items in the keyword search, they show up in here. It's really pretty easy, and if you want to just cancel out of your search, you just hit the X or just select one of the tabs over here, and then you're back into your normal browsing mode using the tree view. The search functionality that's built in is uh, very quick, and you can find items uh, depending on how you've labeled them uh, rather quickly and easily using that. Well, that's all for the search functionality. Search functionality.